Are, you, are, you, are we going? We're rolling. Okay. <laughs> wow. Um, Joshua Waller, so appreciate you taking the time yeah, to totally. uh, allow us to get to know a little bit more mm. of who you are. Yeah. Um, you can find Joshua on the Israel Guys on YouTube, which has been really fun to watch. And we feel like we already know you a little bit, but you have such an amazing story mm. about... Um, about how you've come to this place. Yeah. Um, you've shared so much with us already, but yeah. <laughs> but for our friends and family, I'd just love sure. it if you sure, recap sure. a little bit. Sure. Who are you, man? Yeah, well, this is not such my Israel guys uniform here, but uh, <laughs> we've been out, we just got 200 trees in the ground today, so this is a, wow. a huge uh, blessing. But uh, we came here 18 years ago. Where? Is, well, from we, Tennessee. Yeah. From Tennessee. Yeah. And you said we're on the Mount of Blessing. We're on the Mount of Blessing. And, and for Blessing Broker, it is such an honor to be on the Mount of Blessing. Yeah, yeah. It's a blessed place. It's it, a major blessing to be one of actually live here. But there's yeah. something really special that happened just uh, a little ways away from here. Yeah, I mean, you're talking about biblical lands here. I mean, this is, the, you can't get more grounded, right? We're on the Mount of Blessing, the Mount of Cursing right beside us. Obviously, the tribes of Israel came here for the first time. We also have uh, right next to us, Omo and Moray. This is where the mountain where God called Abraham said, I'm going to take you to, follow me, right? I'm going to take you to the place of, of the Mount of Blessing where God promises to Abraham, land of Israel. He says, to you and your descendants, I'll give this land, and through you all the nations will be blessed, right? Uh, so that happens right next door to here. Wow. So that's the, uh, I mean, we have Shiloh here, you got Bethel here, you got, uh, you know, this is the area just around us, uh, Shechem. Uh, Shechem right next to us. Uh, so many biblical places. You could, it's just incredible uh, to be in this this format. But we came 18 years ago from Tennessee uh, to this area, so biblically loaded. Uh, we had no idea that the, the prophecies were literally happening. Ezekiel 36, mountains of Israel shoot forth your branches. We started here. There was a, a couple hundred vines in the ground. Mm -hmm. Today there's over 500 acres just flowing. Wow. Out of these hills. Wow. Uh, you talk about just life returning. When yeah. we first came, there was only, uh, what, the Jewish presence came back to the Judea and Samaria. Before this was Jordan. This is literally Jordan we're sitting here. Right now, right? 1967. Yeah. The miracle War. Six days, God gave right. Israel back this land. Wow. And Jewish families started to come back here. So, you know, since 1967, we've seen a major uh, Jewish people coming back. We have more than 800,000 Jews now living in this Judea, Samaria area uh, connected to Jerusalem, East Jerusalem. So... People are coming back. Uh, we have farmers that are starting to farm again in these areas. And that's where we really came in, called to, to help these guys. you got Jeremiah 31 that says, you'll plant vines in the mountains of Israel. Uh, Isaiah 61, 5 talks about the nations coming and being a part of that. Wow. Uh, so we feel like we're called to, to serve the people of Israel. That's our mission here is just to serve. Uh, and you're not working as employees or no, contractors for no. other farmers. No, no. It's all volunteer. 100% volunteer. We just come in and say, how can we help you? Now, how many how many uh, different countries have come and served sure. here as uh, volunteers? Well over thirty now. Uh, I don't Look have the exact the, count now, but well over thirty. The nations come to worship. Sure. Yeah. It's in Isaiah, Israel. Uh, what is it? Isaiah forty nine. That the, the, the uh, God's house, the house of prayer for all nations. All nations are supposed to be a part of this worship. The God that's coming here. You know, it's and it's worship. When we see this land for two thousand years that was totally destroyed. Today, yeah. I said we put two hundred trees in the ground. That's reversing the desolation that was over this land for 2,000 years. Yeah. And now it's replacing it with, with really we're seeing a tangible piece of restoration that's coming back to the land of Israel. And this is literally, there's volunteers from over 30 nations that are coming and touching this, getting that dirt like I got right here on my hands. Dirt on their hands being a part of reversing that desolation that was, that was here. That was prophesied, by the way. Yeah. And it happened. Yeah. And now we're seeing the restoration that was also prophesied, which... Boy, is it not a good thing to be a part of the restoration? I would, you know, two thousand years of this desolation, and now yeah. we have the opportunity to be here in this in this incredible time that Israel is being restored. And you know, there are so many people who will come to this land and they'll go see dead stones all over the place. <laughs> That's so true. And and if you yeah. want to be a part of a tour of living stones, you need to reach out to these guys yeah. and come serve in the land of Israel. Yeah. Get your hands and feet dirty mm -hmm. with the soil um, by harvesting and also by planting yeah. with Hayabel. And you guys are just doing amazing things. And yeah, we, thank you. We, we thank you so much. Yeah. It's so such such an honor to get yeah. to know you a yeah. little bit. Yeah. So Great. Thank you so much. Thank you. Now, yeah, what you do you say we go eat something? We're going to have to go get some dinner now. That's right. Okay. <laughs>